the G-Men, coming off a week one victory against the Eagles, take on another division rival in the Washington Redskins here at MetLife Stadium. After a first quarter that was as quiet as a church mouse, we'll pick things up in the second quarter. Chapman hooks up with Odell Beckham Jr. on the play-action bootleg. He tippy toes his way down the sidelines for a few extra yards. Later on, it's a fourth and one gutsy call from Tony D'Amato, but Niall Davis makes it pay off because he gets the first down. Second and ten now later in the drive. Play action bootleg once again, this time to the right, and he hooks up with Randall Cobb this time, and he gets down into Eagles territory, down to their 28-yard line, but the Giants with the settle for a field goal. The Robbie Gould kick is up, and it is good. It's a 3-0 Giants lead over the Redskins. Towards the end of the second now, Ryan Tannehill, the new quarterback of the Redskins, could not get it going, and they would have to turn the ball over. Big thanks to that play right there from Brandon Boykin, the former Eagle. And the G-Men get the ball back here towards the end of the second as Chapman hooks up with Cruz with one second left. He gets out of bounds. Attempt for a field goal to make it a 6-0 lead heading into halftime, but the win is just too strong here in East Rutherford. And it would be a 3-0 in the third quarter. Giants with the ball now hand up to Niall Davis. He gets the first down and some more. Big run from Niall Davis. He had a big day on the ground. 20 carries, 105 yards. And then later in the drive, first and 10 on the 47, Chapman hooks up with Victor Cruz on the out route. He tippy toes his way to stay in bounds. And first and 10 later in the drive, handoff to Niall Davis, runs into his own lineman, breaks a tackle, but you cannot bring this man down. He's in the end zone. Niall Davis, like I said, 20 carries, 105 yards and a touchdown. So far on the day, more from him here as he gets up the gut for some tough guy running. He gets the first down, down to the 37. Later on the drive, it's third and four on the 31. Chapman fires for Garrett Graham, but it's picked off by the Redskins. And they return it down to the 25-yard line. And the Redskins take over with 8.03 left in the fourth. Tannehill gets sacked. The very next play by Paul Warlow, and the fumble is picked up by Kona Preston. So a pick, a sack, and back to black plays, and then the first Giants play. Give it to Niall Davis. He's in the end zone breaking tackles. He has two touchdowns on the day, and big part to him, it's a 17-0 Giants victory here in week two over the Washington Redskins. The Giants are 2-0 in the season, and the Redskins drop to 0-2. Don Chapman was 11 for 22 and 183 yards in the air. He threw two picks, but it did not matter as Niall Davis' running of 20 carries, 105 yards, and two touchdowns was enough to give the Giants the 17-0 victory over the Skins. Now with that being said, let's wrap things up here in East Rutherford, New Jersey for this matchup. Don't forget to tune in next time here as the Giants will stay at home to play host to the Seattle Seahawks in Week 3. I've been your host, Jersey Board, and I'm saying... Goodbye. I don't need your car descending. Words about me looking lonely. I don't need your arms to hold.